then I said, Ed, do you have any kids at home? He said, yes, I have an eight-year-old daughter. I said, what I want you to do is sit her down and say, daddy's going to tell you some stories about some interesting people he works with. Because if you can keep the attention of your eight-year-old daughter, there is a vague possibility you can keep the attention to 524 to 28-year-old gap managers. Practice your stories on your children. And I said, Ed, I want you to be so good that every time your daughter hears you come in, she runs over and says, Daddy, 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 tell me some more stories about those interesting people you work with. Because, of course, if you're going to speak in front of 500 gap managers and all the executives, you have to practice and rehearse so that you can have fun. And he was the first executive on stage in that meeting that got a standing ovation. And this is the secret is that when you are telling stories, you have to tell stories and populate those stories with flesh and blood characters that they relate to.